The raiders only wanted Buckeye's rifle, his supplies, and the mule. Stealing the flock would only slow down the small band of fugitives on the run. One buck couldn't resist the temptation to pick up some provisions on the hoof. To get rid of the determined lady, the renegade decided to ride her down. <laughs> his hands full as Hercules came into striking distance. A skittish horse, a struggling lamb, and a raging dog were too much for him. hurt, Lady wasn't about to give up. Once, cantankerous straying off had been a good thing. The Indians hadn't seen the wayward mule. The raiders had overlooked something else. Buckeye's canteen and shoulder pouch. The old herder set his mind against the pain. There was no time to lose. He was more worried about the sheep than about his wound. If early snows came, the flock would perish. Getting word to Bill Schreiner was all Buckeye could think about. <laughs> Devoted dogs were left alone with the flock and a hundred and one problems. Time passed slowly in the high country. The herder had been gone for several days, but the dog stayed right on the job. Lady's injured leg was slow to mend. 
getting food became a problem, for Buckeye had always fed them. There was only one hunk of venison left in camp, but it was way out of reach. The hungry boomer decided to look elsewhere. 